Hello there, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna show you how to make a clam, okay? You know that something that we eat from the sea or maybe any water. Okay, I'm gonna delete the light and the camera. Which I shouldn't do it because it's I can just hide it. Now I'm gonna use the default cube. Press control one. Good and low poly style. Got something like that. Scale. Something over there, that's gonna be the clamp. Okay. Hmm. Does it shape like clamp now? Well, uh, for me, yeah. Let's go to here. Maybe GG this one. Make something like that. Let's scale it again. Adjust it until you got a shape that you wanted. Okay. It's completely up to you. And now let's apply this one, the subjoint surface. This is how I made. I don't know how you made. That's completely up to you. And, uh, set press one. Enable this one. Snap. Grab the 3x. I'm gonna zoom it a little bit. I'm gonna make sure this one at the center. And there we go. Okay. So now we. I want to separate these two objects. Okay. I'm gonna go to face select. Face select. Go to select that one. This. 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 And this. And I'm gonna press Y. Press Y. Separate them, okay? Now, you see nothing happened. But let's grab this. It's actually separated, okay? Now I'm gonna turn off the magnet tool. Press 1. And I'm gonna set this one. Oh, before we do that, it's better to separate these two, okay? Press P. Separate by loose part. Let's check this one. Set the origin to the 3D cursor. And let's rotate that a little bit. Something of there. Okay, this one now. You know what? I think I should rotate this one. Rotate it uh, 90 degree. Huh? Uh, whatever. No need to rotate. I'll adjust it when I want. Okay, so you've got the clump like that. And let's let's make the the tongue. But before we do that. Let's confirm this one first, okay? If it's okay, then you can, uh, what do you call, join this together again, okay? But it's not okay yet. So, I'm gonna, let's see, maybe I need to adjust a little. Mm, nope, I don't need to adjust. So, yeah, let's, it's two, control J to join. Set the origin to the geometry, okay? And now let's, uh, this two up here. There's two here. I'm gonna bridge edge loops there. Right click to bridge, to bridge edge loop. Okay. Got something like that. Look at that. Very interesting. And now let's add some subdivision surface on it. But we're gonna make it low poly. Okay. Don't go to something like this. This is high. Uh, this one is, well, it's also high, but it should be fine. And this one. Completely okay. <laughs> okay. Now we got something like that. Let's make the tongue. Okay. I'm going to apply this one first. So apply that one. Let me see. If any doubles. Nope, we don't have double. That's good. Now let's make the tongue. I'm going to add a... I'm going to add a sphere now. Let's make the tongue, right? I'm, I'm just going to make the... What do you call it? the body there? Scale. What is this one? Scale, scale, up, oh, scale, shift Z. Grab. No need to go, go serious on this. Shift there, over there. Make it a little bit. Make it something like that. Now I'm gonna do this one. There. Maybe enable this one. The what do you call it? the proportional editing? Grab that. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, okay. okay. Let's separate this first. I lose part. Okay, now it's all separated. So it should be fine now. I'm gonna go to edit mode. Select the verse in the middle there. Edit. It. There we are. Go to edit mode. This one. Now go there. Grab that over there. What is that? 
increase the what do you call it? the influence right back to the air over there grab it again i think potato <laughs> something like tongueish look now this is bad i think it's bad it is bad grab that okay decrease the what you call it yeah that's gonna be the tongue <laughs> which doesn't look so cool let's increase some subdivision surface ah that's bad very bad so it's better just keep like this okay i'm not gonna add any uh what do you call the subdivision surface yes i'm not gonna add anything but i'm gonna add few loop cuts no i'm not gonna add control b or uh, control shift b okay this is bad topology okay very very bad but yeah it's a process of learning <laughs> now let's solidify this one the subdivision surface not so solidify make it thicker depends on your liking okay something like that control a to apply or just hit oh, oh i just said apply <laughs> and this one yeah look at that just make yourself a clam a clam yes a clam now let's shading now let's sh shading it okay i don't know what paint you you all use but i'm gonna use one paint only okay the base color base color i'm gonna go something like darkish there the tongue oh for the tongue i'm gonna x that one uh x that one too oh oh my gosh what did i do let's try it again this one go over there decrease the color a little bit i don't need the roughness but i need the specular and this one i'm gonna be something not not pinkish but something like that ish that's too much that's something like that that's gonna be the tongue there oh look at that yeah also looks fine now <laughs> let's see the tongue i don't need the roughness but i speckle over there but i need to speckle just a little bit so yeah that's how i make a simple clam which is very boring but if you're a beginner then you should start something like this first okay okay so that's how i make my clam guys notice this one thing difference here is this one the tongue okay what the tongue before used like there's a lot of circle but now there are lots of uh, what do you call the cube okay that's because i re i use a remesh on it okay this one the remesh so that's all for today thanks for watching hope you have fun learning these uh, quite fun for simple stuff and good for beginner okay so yeah oh one more thing next week i will be changing my schedule okay instead of posting every day i'm gonna i'm gonna make a tutorial every maybe maybe monday wednesday and friday only and maybe sometime tuesday and thursday but let's i'm i'm gonna well let's see how i'm how i'm gonna change my schedule okay so that's all for today thanks for watching and i'll see you next time okay happy blendering